Hello, sports fans and baseball fans. It's me, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke, and I'm I'm back with another game in my 2020 uh, Phillies Imagine season. As you might recall, if you've been following this, the Phillies are doing horribly, and they still are. Philadelphia comes into this game against the LA Angels with a record of 36 and 62. And they lost the first two games of the series to the Angels. This is the third and final game of the series, and the Phillies looking for a win to walk away with at least one win here. So uh, with the 36-62 and 62 record, the Phillies are the second worst team in Major League Baseball in the Imagine season, the worst team being the Detroit Tigers, who are a game or two worse than that. Um, so, uh, you know, with that, let's get on with the game. Uh, again, the same thing applies. You've got the score right here. You've got the scoreboard where I go, I track the inning, what inning we're in. So if you're listening to the game and then you look up, you can see instantly what inning we're in, uh, or almost instantly in some cases, and what the score is. Um, I will go over the lineups as we get to the lineups. The pitching matchup today for the... LA Angels will be Patrick Sandoval, who comes into this game with a record of 2-1 and one on the season, and uh, Zach Eflin for our Philadelphia Phillies. He is 3-7 and seven on the season. So uh, the Angels are up first. Let's go over their lineup. They will start with uh, Luis Rangifo, will lead off and play second base. Shohei Otani will be the DH batting second. Mike Trout bats third and will be the center fielder. Uh, Rendon will be at third base, batting fourth. Batting in the fifth spot will be David Fletcher, the shortstop. Jared Walsh will bat sixth and play first base. Um, Justin Upton will be the left fielder, batting seventh. Taylor Ward will play right field and bat eighth. And batting ninth will be Anthony Benboom, the catcher. Benboom. The catcher. So, with that lineup ready to face Eflin, let's go. Let's hope the Phillies can get their 37th win here of the season. Luis Rangifo. And he gets a 6 9. He would be batting left. And so that is going to be a home run. Rangifo leads off with a home run. So, uh, let's put that one in the books. And right off the bat, Eflin is in trouble. It's one nothing, and Shohei Otane is up. And he gets a 1-6. That is a strikeout. So Eflin rebounds nicely, strikes out Otani. And Mike Trout is the batter. Mike Trout getting a 6-6. And that is going to be a strikeout. So Eflin, I guess, was caught a little off guard there by Rangifo and allowed that home run. But now he settled down a little bit and struck out Otani and Trout. And then Anthony Rendon, the third baseman, is up. He gets a 4-10 batting right, and that's going to be a fly out to left. So no runs come in. We go to the bottom of the second, and I have to get the one run. For the Angels, who lead one nothing. The lineup for the Phillies will be Roman the Amazing Quinn leading off and playing center field. Andrew McCutcheon will bat second and play left. Bryce Harper will play right field and bat third. Um, Reese Hoskins will be the first baseman batting in the cleanup spot. Jay Bruce will bat in the fifth spot and play DH. Gregorius is the shortstop, batting sixth. Segura bats seventh and plays second. Andrew Knapp will be playing for the injured Real Muto at catcher today in the eighth spot. And Alec Baum will be the third baseman, batting in the ninth spot. Roman Quinn is up, and he gets a 6-10 and uh, he is going to be batting um, 
right. He's a switch hitter. And that is going to be an out. One away. So he uh, he flies out to center. McCutcheon is the batter with one down. And that is a 2-8, and that's going to be a fly ball to center as well. Two flies to the center fielder, and then Harper coming up to the plate. And he gets a 3-4, which is a walk. Yeah. So Sandoval allows his first base runner in the person of <coughs> Bryce Harper, and Reese Hoskins is the batter. He gets a 4-7, and 4-7 is going to be also a walk. So after getting the first two outs very quickly, Sandoval has walked back-to-back -back batters, and Jay Bruce is now the hitter. He gets a 5-4, batting left. That's going to be a fly to center. Their center fielder is a 2-E-4. That is, of course, Trout. That is a 16, so I think that's probably an out. And it is. So we had three flies to center field and two walks, but uh, no runs come in. David Fletcher is up, top of the second. And he gets a 1-9, and that is going to be a ground ball to the second baseman. One down, and Jared Walsh is the batter. He gets a 6-9 batting left. And that is going to be a an out. And let's see, what kind of an out? That is going to be a fly out to center field. And Upton is the batter. And he gets a 3-2. And that is going to be a hit by pitch plus injury. And it's a 16, so he is out for a while. We'll have to get a, a pinch runner for Upton. To be very low on. It's going to be Franklin Barreto. Franklin Barreto will go in. And uh, he is actually a running 1-15 to anyway. Uh, but he is also a um, he is also a stealing C so he isn't going to steal probably He also isn't a very good left fielder, but, you know, they don't have a lot of depth there. So Barreto is aboard with two outs and um, and Taylor Ward up. And he gets a 1-7, and that is going to be a single double asterisk. So there are runners at the corners. With Anthony Ben Boom. Ben Boom. And he gets a 2 5, and that is going to be a strikeout. So they're out of the inning. Eflin gave up another hit. He struck out another man. And uh, we go to the bottom of the second. Still 1 0 Angels. 
And, J and not Jay Bruce. Jay Bruce batted last inning. So Gregorius is the batter. And he gets a 110, and that is going to be a... That is going to be a single. It's barely a single for him. Infield, or a, uh, a ballpark single. That is a hit. First hit allowed by Sandoval. Gene Segura. Well, Segura gets a 410 batting right. And that is going to be a walk. So we've got two guys on. we got a little something going here against Sandoval. And Andrew Knapp is the batter. And Andrew Knapp gets a 5-2, and he would be batting right. And that is going to be... Is it? Is it? It is not going to be a ballpark home run. Um, right. It's going to be a fly out to left. Wait a minute. No, it's going to be a single double asterisk. Because it, fall, it falls within the range to be a ballpark homer, but he is weak against, he has weak power against lefties. So he wouldn't get a home run against the lefty off of that. Um, I don't think. So I'm, I'm going to say it's a single double asterisk and knocks in a run. I don't know if a ballpark homer overrides somebody being weak against that, um, but um, if so, well, then so be it. But he does knock in a run, and there's still no outs. So, And it is a tie game. Alec Baum is the batter, and he gets a 1-9, and that is going to be a ground ball shortstop double play, two outs, but a run scores. The runner comes in from third. And the Phillies have a 2-1 to one lead with that, and Roman Quinn up. And he gets a 5-8 batting uh, left, and that is going to be a ground ball to the second baseman. The second baseman for them is a 3-E-12. That is a 13, and uh, that is going to be an out. So he goes out 4-3. But the Phillies do get two runs, so I'll go get the two-run spot. And the Phillies have a two-to-one lead. As we go to the top of the third. And Rangifo, the top of the order for the Angels, is up. He gets a 5-7. He would be batting left. That is a ground ball to the second baseman. Our second baseman is a 2E10. Um, and that is a 13, so that's an out. One down, and Shoei Otani. Is. And he gets a 6-10. 6-10, batting left. That is going to be a single. Another hit given up by Eflin. That's the third hit he's allowed this game. And Mike Trout is the batter with a man aboard and one out. And he gets a 2-9, and that is going to be a home run. And now the Angels take the lead. And that's the second home run he's allowed. All the runs that he's allowed have been on home runs. Anthony Rendon is up. 
he gets a 6-7 batting right. And that's going to be a ground ball third base. So he goes out 5-3, and there's two down in the inning. And David Fletcher. And he gets a 5-9 batting right, and that is going to be a ground ball short. Shortstop is a 2-E-20. That is a 17. It is an out, 6-3. But the Angels get two, and they take the lead again. We have to go get the three spot for them. And they lead 3-2. We have McCutcheon coming up against Sandoval. Both pitchers are struggling here in this game. And McCutcheon is a batter. And he gets a 2-5, and uh, against a left-hander, that is going to be a single. McCutcheon with a hit. That's the third hit allowed by Sandoval. And Bryce Harper's in. not going to do anything tricky with him. 3-5, that is going to be a single. So now we got two runners on again. Like we had uh, last inning, two consecutive uh, base runners to start the inning. And Reese Hoskins up. No outs. And he gets a 210, which is going to be a ground ball. Oh, wait a minute. It's going to be a ground ball pitcher A. Yep. So the runner goes to third, but there's two down now with a runner 90 feet away. And Jay Bruce the back. And he gets a 5-6 batting left. And that's going to be a ground ball second base. So we came close to scoring there, but we didn't. We go to the top of the fourth. With the score, Angels 3, Phillies 2, Jared Walsh is up. He gets a 2-2, two -two, and that is going to be a strikeout. Fourth strikeout for Afflin. Franklin Barreto, who came on for the injured Upton, is up, and he gets a 1-4, and that's going to be a hit by pitch. So he has a, I, th I guess Eflin has a problem hitting the guy that bats in that spot. But it isn't an injury, so he just goes to first base, and he's down there. Looking fine with the strike with the one out in the inning and Taylor Ward. Taylor Ward gets a 3-7. That is going to be a fly to center. And Bam Boom, the catcher, is up. And he gets a 5-8. Batting left, and that is going to be a strikeout. So Eflin strikes out two guys in the inning. And he gets out of the inning without allowing another run, thankfully. We go to the bottom of the fourth inning. We're moving along here. Didi Gregorius gets a 5-5. Five, five. And he is going to be hitting a double. Oh, wait a minute. Nope. Well, I'm looking at the wrong guy. Yeah, that's a strikeout. Strikeout, I was looking at the wrong pitcher. So Sandoval with the K. Segura's up. Segura gets a 3-8. And that's going to be a ground ball second. There's two down and Andrew Knapp up. 5-9 for him is going to be a ground ball to the shortstop. Their shortstop is a 3-E-18. That is an 8. So it's going to be on the E-18. We got it on the air rate. And that is a 7. 
and a seven is going to be a ground ball, so he is out. No runs come in for us. We go to the top of the fifth. A very close game here. Three to two Angels. Both pitchers seem to have settled down a little bit, though. Rangifo back to the top of the lineup for them. He gets a 2-6, which is a strikeout. There is one down, and Shohei Otane is up. He gets a 3-4. That's a fly to center. And Mike Trout is the batter with two down and nobody on. And he gets a 1-5, and that is a strikeout. No runs come in. We go to the bottom of the fifth. Andrew Knapp, or no, not Andrew Knapp. Al Alec Baum is the batter. And he gets a 1-7, and that is going to be a single. So let's see if we can string together a couple of hits to lead this inning off like we have in two previous innings. Roman Quinn. He gets a 6-5 batting right, and that's going to be a fly ball to right. One away with McCutcheon is the bat. He gets a 4-7, and that's going to be a walk. So we do have two on. There's one out. We didn't get the first two guys on, but we do have two guys on. And Sandoval has walked his fourth guy. Harper is up. Harper gets a 2-5, and that is going to be a uh, that's going to be a single to left field. Let's see who we have as a lead runner. Lead runner is Bomb. I don't think we're going to send Bomb. No, he's a running one to eleven. So we're just going to keep the bases loaded. And we're going to get some action up in the L.A. bullpen. No Ramirez is up and throwing for the Angels. The bases are loaded. There's only one out. And Hoskins is the batter. And he gets a 3-4, and that is going to be a single to left field. So that scores bomb, and we could send um, we could send McCutcheon, but let's see what he, he is running. And let's record that he gave up another run, that um, Sandoval gave up the tying run. And uh, let's see what McCutcheon is running. He is a 1-14. to 14. This was to right field. Their right fielder's arm is a plus 1. It's a 1-15. to 15. I'm going to try it. And he makes it. He makes it on an 8, so he easily makes it. So McCutcheon also scores... On that base hit. Which now puts us in the lead. Runners at first and second. One out. And um, and Jay Bruce is the batter. And he gets a 1-8. And that is going to be a strikeout. Sandoval strikes out. Bruce. There's two down. And Gregorius is up. They're going to let the lefty face the lefty. Sandoval facing Gregorius. And that's a 3-8. And that is going to be a line out to shortstop. 
But we get two runs there and take a 4-3 lead. So let's go get the four. And Rendon is up in the top of the sixth. He gets a 3-7, and that's a walk. We are going to get some action up in our bullpen. David Phelps is going to be up in our pen with David Fletcher at the plate. Nobody out and one guy on. He gets a 210. That's going to be a ground ball shortstop B. So now Fletcher is at first base on the fielder's choice. And Jared Walsh is up. Jared Walsh gets a 5-6, batting left, and that's going to be a strikeout. There's two down. And Barreto is the batter. And he gets a 6-8, batting right, and that is going to be a single double asterisk. So now the Angels have runners at the corners. You got a righty up. I'm going to bring in Phelps right now. So Eflin goes five and two thirds. And we're bringing in David Phelps. Good morning, Mr. Phelps. Your mission, should you choose to accept it, is to get us out of this inning. Taylor Ward is up. And he gets a 5-8 batting right, and that is going to be a ground ball to the second baseman. He is a 2-E-10. That is a 13, and that is going to be an out, 4-3. So Phelps comes on and stops the run, any runs from scoring. We go to the bottom of the sixth, still leading 4-3 here. And they are going to bring, the Angels are going to bring in no Ramirez. So Sandoval only goes um, five. Wait a minute, where are we right now? He goes, yeah, he only goes five. And um, no Ramirez is coming in. Segura is up. He gets a 1-5, and Ramirez is a righty, and that's going to be a single. Ramirez allows a base hit. We've got a man aboard. And Knapp is up. I'm just going to let him hit. Got a feeling about that. 6-3, he's batting left. And that is going to be a ballpark homer, but again, up against, oh, well, wait a minute, Ramirez is a righty, so now this time it is a home run. So he actually gets the home run, the ballpark homer. Yeah. So Ramirez gives up a hit, two runs, another hit, two runs, and a home run by none other than Andrew Knapp. And Alec Baum is the batter. 
And he gets a 2-8, which is going to be a fly ball to right. That's one out. Roman Quinn is up. Roman Quinn getting a 2-6. That's going to be a strikeout. Ramirez striking out his first guy, and McCutcheon is the bat. And McCutcheon gets a 2-9, which is a single. Ramirez came in and he just kind of threw gasoline on the fire and Harper is up. And he gets a 6-3 batting left. And that is going to be a ballpark home run. And so we, we, we're taking a big lead now. Ramirez just came in and completely fell apart. And uh, Harper is three for three with a walk and two RBIs. And Hoskins is the bat. And he gets a 5-9 batting right, and that is going to be a strikeout. So that is the inning, but it featured two home runs, one by Harper and one by Knapp, of all people. And so we scored four runs in the sixth inning, and we take a an eight, three, four, five, six, yep, eight uh, to three lead. So we'll go get the eight. We're all the way up to the eights. I didn't even think we would get there. But anyway, we're in the top of the seventh. And so definitely, I mean, I was thinking about taking um, Phelps out. But now I'm leaving him in because, I mean, we got a huge lead. Uh, 110 for Taylor Ward against a righty. And that is going to be a single. So let's not get... Let's not get too carried away because this could be a problem. Oh, wait a minute. No, no. This That was uh, is supposed to be Ben Boom. And I think he, let's see, 110, ballpark single. He is out. So he gets a uh, ground ball pitcher. One away because it was Ben Boom instead of Taylor Ward. So he goes out one to three. And Rangifo is up. Rangifo gets a five six batting left. That's going to be a strikeout. Phelps strikes a man out. And Otani. Is up. And Otani gets a 3-3, and that's going to be a ground ball second base. No runs come in. We go to the bottom of the seventh, leading 8-3. Might get our 37th win of the season here. Jay Bruce is up. Oh, wait, we're going to take out no Ramirez. So no Ramirez only goes one inning because it was a terrible inning, and uh, they don't want to, the uh, Angels don't want any part of that. So they're going to bring in Ty Buttery. Ty Buttery is coming in, and Jay Bruce is going to face him. He is a righty. That is a 5-5, five five, batting left. That is going to be a home run, Jay Bruce who leads our team in home runs, I think with 21, and maybe that's his 22nd right there. So Buttery gets, uh, he gets faced uh, with um, an immediate run, scoring on a home run. A lot of home runs in this game. There's been uh, five home runs in this game. Gregorius is the batter. He gets a 4-6 batting left. And that's going to be a ground ball first.
One down for Segura. He gets a 112. That's going to be a fly to left. And Andrew Knapp is up. Andrew Knapp having himself a day here. 1-8. That is, he just misses another home run. That's a fly ball to left. But he's, I mean, he's knocked in three runs today with a home run and a single. He is two for four, so yeah. But anyway, we don't get any more runs. Oh, wait, yes, we do. We got the Bruce home run in the bottom of the seventh. So we've got nine runs we have to put up there. And we're going to the top of the eighth. And uh, we're going to keep, uh, we're definitely going to keep Phelps out there. I mean, he hasn't done anything bad yet. I mean, he hasn't allowed anybody on base. Mike Trout is the batter. 6-6, six, six, batting right, and that's going to be a strikeout. Second strikeout for Phelps against no hits, no walks. And Rendon is up. He gets a 3-5. That is going to be a fly ball to left. And that brings up Fletcher, Mr. Fletcher. Gets a 1-5, and that is going to be a double. So that's the first hit that, um, and that's the first hit that Phelps is even allowed. And Jared Walsh is out. And he gets a 5-9, batting left. That's a strikeout. Phelps strikes out his third guy. He doesn't allow any runs to score. We go to the bottom of the eighth. And they're gonna keep they're gonna keep buttery out there for the bottom of the eighth. Alec Baum is the batter. He gets a 2-5, and that's going to be a strikeout. One down, and Roman Quinn back to the top of the lineup with Roman Quinn, and he gets a 6-6. Six, six. And that's going to be a that's going to be a strikeout. Wait, yeah, it's a strikeout. And um, McCutcheon is the batter, and he gets a 1-6, and that is going to be a strikeout. So he strikes out the side. Buttery comes on and strikes out the side. We go to the top of the ninth. I'm going to take Phelps out. So Phelps um, goes, let's see, he was one-third into the sixth, and then... Two and a, so he goes two and a third. And we're going to bring in... We're going to bring in Brandon Workman. Workman having a terrible year, but then again, um, we have a huge lead here. We've got a... Uh, six run lead so i don't think they're going to be able to get six runs off of um off of workmen they might be able to get a few but i don't think six and barreto is the batter he gets a five seven batting right and that is going to be a single Barreto getting a hit, Workman giving up a hit. Taylor Ward is up. Taylor Ward gets a 210. That is going to be a shortstop double play, ground ball shortstop double play. So there's two down quickly, and Ben Boom is the batter. And he gets a 2-7, that's a fly to center. 
So Workman does get out of it um, easily. And the final score here is the uh, Angels only got three runs and we got nine. And the Phillies win it 9-3, win their 37th game of the year. Uh, the win going to Eflin and the loss going to Sandoval as they were losing when he left the game. And that is going to be it for me, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke, signing up.